Hello, so I'm Sue and this is Pamela Plaster Technician and we've got our lovely model Anne and this time we're going to demonstrate how to put on a back slab and this is going to be a cylinder back slab. This would be used for a dislocated patella or a fracture to the patella. Um, we are going to measure three slabs and this time Pam is going to use three 20 metre slabs. Um, everybody's legs are different shapes and sometimes the leg at the top is slightly broader. We may sometimes in some circumstances get away with using a back slab at the back which is 20 centimetre and then two 15 centimetres down the side. Because the leg tapers in this case we are going to put, put on uh, the three 20 centimetre bandages. Okay I think we're ready to go so Pam is going to measure first of all the size of the leg and this goes from the top of the thigh to above the ankle and she'll measure her slabs first. So now we have our three slabs ready to go. And Pam has got some padding now and she's also going to pre-shrink some cotton bandages ready to apply at the end to secure the slab in place. Okay, so I'm going to lift your leg up while Pam puts the padding on. I'm going to start at the top, allowing for a turn back at the top. I need to keep the knee just a natural flexion, so about five degrees. It goes all the way down to the ankle. Okay. Allow for a turn put back. Down. Put your leg down. Just lift. Just but that's it. Put your leg down. Okay. Okay. I'm starting off with the side slabs. Do the inner one there first. Okay, so if you just okay. leg up for me, you can just hold the bottom one for me there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Pam's now applying the back slab. Keep the knee in five degree flexion, just natural flexion. Just make sure the knee is nice and straight in line with the toes. And keeping the foot up at 90 degrees there.
I'm just trimming a little bit of plaster off at the end there just so it doesn't rub on the ankle joint. Just turn back the padding and now I'm going to secure with the bandage. knot is nicely tied and now we need to put a, a pillow or blanket just underneath the knee there so just know. to give some support okay just to allow the plaster now to harden off so that is a cylinder back slab for you